Hey guys, this is KSP with Tape, and today I'm playing a very old version, a uh, version 0.8.2. Um, this is a very old version, as you can see. When you click start, you don't get any options, you just go straight to this old looking space center with lakes, which I actually quite like. Um, uh, blocky mountains and just no space plane hangar. Um, roads, but you know, no space plane hangar, hangar. And when you go in here, you have the pod as default, can't change anything about that, except it's can't even change its orientation. Um, you have to go upwards. And you can see in terms of propulsion I have very few things. And I have very few parts, so what I'm thinking is a challenge for today is to build a rocket in KSP 0.8.2 using every part. I can use each part as much as I like because there aren't that many propulsion parts. Um, but I just want to use every part. So. I will need an upper stage. Uh, oh no, I'll need a decoupler for that, won't I? Um, so we'll put that on there, and uh, that'll do for an upper stage, I guess. Um, this is so old, and the graphics are so... I don't know if there's any... there's no zooming or anything, and the graphics are so grainy and things, but it's... Um, I forgot where I found this, in a forum. I got it ages ago, and actually did another video. Um, and then deleted it because uh, they didn't upload it because I really hated the video I did. But anyway, um, right, let's make a two-stage rocket with boosters. So I need to use this. Um, I need to use every part, obviously. So it does have symmetry, um, which is good. Nope, doesn't have duplicate. That's annoying. Right. Yeah, let's build a huge lower stage. I There's no, like, indicators or map view, so I don't really know what orbit is. But uh, I think it's actually the atmosphere ends loads lower um, than in uh, KSP. Yeah, not point. Well, not point. Not seven onwards. I think was that. There's no aerodynamics, so I guess. Oh, I have to put some parachutes on, don't I? I'll put that on the top and an SAS module. Um, I have played a bit of this, and I would just like to say, um, if you have any complaints about the current SAS system. Yeah, compared to this, that is the best thing in the world. Um, right, put one of these on top. Crew, can't really do anything with that, don't know why that's there. Needs wings on it, I guess, because I have to use every part. I've used all of them, all of them. Um, these aren't in aerodynamic, they're in structural, so I uh, don't know how much help they'll provide. Hopefully some. Um, I guess I'll put these further up. Now I'll put them on top because that looks badass. <laughs> and you can't rotate the camera in here I don't think. Oh no you can with the right mouse button just not with the arrows. But I can save this craft as... Oh. Well, okay. Okay I can sit... Okay I'll put the craft over there. I can save the craft as... Um, please go to space. All caps. Um, Oh, there's... No, I thought there was, like, um, default ships, like you get Kerbal X. But this is, uh, I think, everything. No launch clamps. Um, a little annoying. Decals. What do I do for decals? Oop. Uh, God knows. All right. Um, I think that's everything. I think that's all of the parts. Yep. Okay. Um, we have a rocket. Can't actually... Uh, oh, I've got to do staging. God, this is horrible looking. Okay, fire the boosters and the engines. Uh, okay. Uh, then... What the hell? Don't know what happened to the boosters just there, but okay. Um, then ditch the boosters. Yep. Then activate all these fuel tanks? I don't know. I, I assume all of these should be down there. Um, I, don't know, I think they're just indicators more than anything else, but I might as well have them all in one stage, it'll be tidy. Um, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus. Okay, let's move all of... It's going to be a lot of sorting. Um, and then these decouplers here. Uh, don't know what if the wings have much relevance. Uh, that ditch is... Yeah, doubt we'll be returning. Don't really know how. Anyway, that's everything. Let's put it on the pad. Right. Okay, that was a very quick load time. It's already... Th oh, there's no instant down. There's no resources tab either. There is still a tower 
Oh, mm, have to use the. I'm really used to these kind of really basic controls. Unused to them. Not used to them. Shut up. Okay, throttle on. What does that button do? Not answer yes, because there is none. All right. I think uh, maximum power should do it. Yep. No struts, by the way. I'm gonna throttle down actually. Uh. Oh crap, I think my power's about to go out. Oh Jesus, it's gone out loads recently. Oh, we are falling. Um, okay, we're going 45 degrees, I guess. Ooh, no, don't, not, oh, this is horrible to fly. This is, oh God. Okay, ditch them. Throttle up. Oh, no control for me. Are oh, the lift's too high up. Okay. Um, end flight. Vehicle assembly building. All right, don't have a lot of thunder. Screw it, I'll just put these on here, it'll be fine. Ooh, very big boom of thunder. I don't know if you just heard that, but it was really, really big and... Okay, let's go again. Throttle down. Wait, what? Of the throttle... Don't know, was it? I think that's over throttle or something. All right, I'm a little worried that my power will... What the... what the fuck? Oh jeez, it's un... oh jeez. I have to restage it. That's annoying. This is a very interesting video about me failing. I'm just gonna move the engines down and hope that everything's fine, I guess. Uh... Whoo, and... Move that up. Nope, move that there. There you go. Let's go to space, eh? In my most racist Italian accent. I'm sorry if you are Italian. I... There we go. There you go. I wonder if Italy has it. We've got the big three. You never have any others than that, because there's no persistence in this game, I'd like to add. Um, you can't keep your ships in orbit. They just kind of do what they like. Um, you have to fly one ship, and then you fly, fly another one. And there's not much of a variety, but look at this uh, Kerbin. Um, no map view. So actually, at the time when this was the main game, um, there was a lot of debate as to whether the world was flat or round, and obviously from here you can see, well, there's a curvature of the Earth, of course it's um, round, but then people said, oh, that's just an effect, is it really round, because you can't see it, I mean, if, and it's really hard to know what to do in terms of getting into orbit, um, so yeah, there was actually, in the history of Kerbal Space Program, there was a debate where, to whether or not Kerbin was round or not, which I think is pretty cool. Um, my vertical speed has peaked out at apparently it's something like 20 meters per second. Okay, we've got. I should be gravity turning, but there's very little control. I don't think these thrust vector. Can't tell. Um, I'm not sure what I have in terms of. I think just yes, I guess. Okay, something. You can see um, each of these fuel indicators is for each individual fuel tank, um, which is fine because there's only one size of fuel tank. I'm trying to tip over, but I have limited control. Ooh. Oh, come on. Let's uh, not don't do the Italian accent again. Well, not even Italian. Um, come on. Tilt over. Tilt over. Tilt over. There's no moon in this either. There is just a uh, curb in. Um, and I one day I want to get into orbit of curb in, in this game. I've never done it. I've, I've got into space and very far and just seem to head away from curb in. Can I tip over if I throttle down? That appears to make it easier, yes. So I, I don't know when the atmosphere ends, I think maybe about 40 kilometers on this version. I could Google it, I have Googled it, but it wasn't very informative. Okay, this is going well, this is going wonderfully. I can't tip over, there is nothing, I, I can spin a bit I guess. Um, yeah, so basically if you have any complaints about um, the current SAS system, this was worse. And I think I've still got tons of fuel left, oh, yeah. This was, this was horrible, and the atmosphere, really soupy. I mean, the current ones um, in like 0.23 is not great. I mean, Ferrum Aerospace kind of aids that, but you know, it's it's not great. Okay, now I'm pointing north, but I am gravity turning a bit, so I'm going to count that as a victory. Could be out of the atmosphere. Not really sure. Don't know what's going on with stuff. I'm just going to max it. Let's just go. Let's just go, man. Let's just Go to space. Oh, yeah, Bill looks scared. Do I have cockpit view? Oh, no, I just have camera. Okay. 
Look, you've got Bill going scared, is scared as hell. You've got Jeb, um, just kind of enjoying it loads, and Bob, no expression. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what's happening with this. It's just, uh, I think I'm starting to tip over now. Yes, victory. I'm going quite fast, upwards. Not really. I don't know what I'm doing. Can I type? Is there time warp? I don't think there's time warp. This is a very limited version of the game. And we're out of fuel on the stage very soon. There you go. Detach that. Now I have control. Let's just burn sideways, I guess. No, no control. Why don't I have control? Oh, it's the old SAS system. I just realized it's the old system where it just locks in place. I completely forgot. Oh, that was, oh, that was stupid. I'm going to burn slightly down. I just, com I completely blanked on that. I thought it was, I'm so used to just being able to turn. Oh, that went well. I'll burn slightly downwards to try and achieve some kind of orbit. Maybe much downwards. I, because, um, if you're not aware, and you've only kind of recently started playing the game, you used to have to keep turning on SAS on and off to get it to work. Kind of, you have to, like, click S, click it on and off to kind of, um, uh, to kind of change whether it's locked in place or not locked in place, whereas now it just locks in place automatically and stuff. So, um, yeah, I screwed that up pretty badly. But hey, we're in space, I reckon. God knows. Um, parachute still goes off in space. Do I have 2D couplers now? That'd be ridiculous. Hell, we may have achieved an orbit, may not. See if I um, pull the parachute now, it pulls like we're in a in um in orbit, uh, in atmosphere even. But uh, yeah, it doesn't really work so well. So yeah, that's. I guess we're in kind of close to an orbit, and you can see it's round now. And uh, yeah, definitely a round curve in people of the past. And it looks like we're in some kind of orbit. I reckon, maybe. No way to tell if I press M, there's no map view. Um, but yeah, there's not really much else in this game right now. I haven't really looked around Kerbin that much. I suppose this is the best I can do. Um, yeah, so you can find this on a forum somewhere. It's, well, I think it's, I didn't pay for it because I paid for the game and this is an old version. But you know, um, yeah, so that's pretty, well, that's all of the parts and pretty much what you can do in the current in the not the current game in the game I'm playing now so yeah I hope you've enjoyed this um, I it's kind of a long shot I just I was thinking of stuff to do and remembered hey I've got an old version of KSP on my computer but yeah um, so I hope this wasn't too boring and was kind of interesting to see how far the game has come in just a billion updates um, so this has been KSP point eight point two with tape I will see you next time